Thank you, Ben. This is John Perner's clock. Okay. Put this board. I want that back. Do you need one of these? Or? I'm going to use this as well. Okay. As long as, we, as long as we're careful to mm -hmm. check each other. I, I've been known to sometimes score for my opponent when, you know, I, I'm, I'm so wrapped up in the math, and then I say, all right, here. <laughs> so let's see. Yeah. I was very tired last night. I just got back from New York where I spent a few days with my mom and dad, and I fell asleep listening to you on YouTube. Oh, no. I did. Oh, I'm glad I can be used as a <laughs> sleeping aid. <laughs> it's nothing you said. <laughs> what, what was it? A great course? It course was, or? it was, yeah, it was math. It was, it was a beautiful course. Oh, and, wonderful. Yeah. All right. Oh, and I get, and I have a clock that I will. Oh, great. Bring out. I was listening to a series, sort of, uh, of you and Mark uh, Olson, Mark David Olson, is that his name? Mark? Mark, Mark Olson of Backhand yeah, yeah, fame? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and he was, it was just, you guys have fantastic YouTube content. You know? Oh, my goodness, All right. Okay, let's see, so I think we're, we're 22 and 12, yeah. Have a good match. that last match now I know it's correct there you go ah, or at least I think so whether the computer agrees I don't know but it makes a whole lot of sense to me makes my six as good down here. Yes. I might have to sneeze because I'm allergic to dust and I can sense it in the room. No. But don't don't stop. Oh, it's okay. okay. I just I don't want you to be surprised if I jolt over there because I don't, <laughs> want, to, I don't <laughs> want to sneeze in front of you. I hear you. There is some dust in here.
not my board? I don't have it. Okay, this, this is mine, but we got it. I just bought the... Uh, yes, yeah, so I don't know. I would have taken. I'm sure. <laughs> I like my position until the sixes. Yeah. And then came the six one, and there was no looking back. Hoping you were going to double me there, but I knew you wouldn't. Yeah. <laughs> so, man, what am I afraid of? A lot of people would have doubled me there. You know, the, ga the chances of getting gammon, of me, me winning the gammon, were pretty small. I just have to ask, what are your chances of turning it around? I just said, you know, even if he rolls like a one six, I can still cash. Yeah. Even if he rolls a one something else, oh, right, right. I can still cash. So as long as I don't do anything silly, like move myself up into a shot, um, like maybe the, you know, and, and I, I can still hope to make a point, play for check. But once I started rolling big, that prospect yeah. was dimming, yeah. I, and I realized I left myself vulnerable to all the six. So I said, ah, which is cash. So, I don't know if that was right, but it was probably not wrong with much.
Hey, Ben. Yeah. Um, right? Yeah, that one is. Uh, ben, I don't know whether the camera has been adjusted on this table since John and, and Art played. I believe so, because I see a blank. Yeah, yeah, we're it's good. okay. It's yeah. showing the board properly. Uh, yeah. I remember starting it, but I'm just going to look at it. Right? Yep. Thank you. Yep. Hanging off a little bit. I guess the back of it art right? lifts it up, but it. Uh, the nice thing is that the dice almost always land in the middle of the table. All right. Should we replay the first game for the? Game? <laughs> <laughs> Normally I can't, but I think between the two of us we might have been able to. All right. That probably shouldn't have worked, but it's <laughs> kind of good. Huh?
stack is probably not right. Probably a balanced play is better. All I know is that that's a good like that. roll. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's tough. That's a tough decision. Something sexy. Something sexy, like two of them. <laughs>
just to take a picture. Oh, sure. You don't mind? No, no. I'll, sh I'll share with you anything I find. Thank you. Thank you. Crazy, but it's my play. Surely would have taken, but
such an interesting visual delta, right? Yeah, it's really. Ten, ten points right here. I'm going to have two cro three crossovers, which is bad. Merely academic now. Was that a proper take? It was. Yeah. Uh, or close enough um, yeah. that I had to know. Um, uh, I don't know. It, it, in, I would guess, given the, I would guess that your chance of winning So in a money game, the point of last take would have been about 65 tips for you. Um, so you were four tips beyond that point of last take. Um, that normally means you're around 15 percent. Think of this score, you need to be 15 percent to take. Mm, so it was not a take. I think it was probably not a proper take. I was expecting you to take. Yeah. yeah. Um, but but I had to wrestle. I mean, at first I thought that it was only three on the point I wanted to take, and it, which would have been right, which would have been the case if our position was a little less strong. Mm -hmm. So that is, you know, when when it's all about rolling high numbers, um, then you have more chance to come from behind when it's sort of become about getting the right number of rolls. And because we have, each have four checkers on the ace and deuce, it was a little, mm -hmm. yeah, it wasn't quite high variance, it wasn't quite low variance, it was like medium variance. That changes you by about that. And for all that calculation. Yeah, yeah. So I think you can, and if you are three beyond the point of last take, I think it would be right on the border of a double. And I think that's where we were the roll before. Yeah. When I, yeah. or two rolls before, whatever, before I rolled the two one, and, and I was thinking yeah. about it there, and I said, I think we're right on the cusp. And whether I, you know, I shouldn't play into the fact that I said, oh, I think he's, He's going to be inclined to take this. He's yeah. going to say, I'm playing yeah. the art. So I'm going to, it's right. a race. There's right. no, I'm not going to make any, <laughs> I'm going to play all my rules perfectly, let's do it. And that would have been rational. But for BMAB, it's like, well, you know, you play, you got to just make the mathematically perfect right. play. Right, right, right. Um, so, um, whether I should have waited, I don't know. I'll take, we'll look at it. Our match is going to be done. Pretty Soon, <laughs> and I and I and I think I I won't be making any more Cuban noise this much. <laughs> I wasn't so sure of your tape. Yeah. 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 Um, 
Yeah, I wasn't. I, I mean, I wasn't sure if I was too good or not. And then you took that. That was a really strange, that 6-5 was such an oddball roll. I was glad to hear that you would have played what I played. No, I think you did the right thing. Yeah. That I'm pretty sure of. Um, you know, you spend all that time saying, well, if I play my this checker yeah. safely, I don't yeah. have a safe way to do it. That gave you a nice tangible asset. You gave me a four-point yeah. uh, uh, four locking structure. Five, but close. We saw the two come out. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, I saw the ace right away. Thank you very much, Art. Uh, Super interesting always to play with you. Sure. I love hearing you talk about the game. Well, we can look at some of the... Let me, let me go upstairs and get uh, my charger. And awesome. It's beautiful. Okay. Uh, do you need a, a, an iPhone charger? Is that what a, you uh, need? No, well, I, you know, I could, look, I could look at it on the, on the iPhone. I was going to look at it on my, uh, on my laptop. But I think it is... Practically out of juice. Oh, well, let's see. I have an iPhone charger with me, but that's not going to help you. Let's see. Well, <laughs> it claims it has 32% juice. Oh. I don't believe it because it, uh, an hour ago it said uh, down to 5% juice. But let's let's put in the position quickly while it thinks it still has <laughs> juice. Say, don't look for Wi Fi. But I don't need it. That might say on the same juice. Oops. Double. I thought it was my board was so strong. Mm -hmm. I was up in the race. Mm -hmm. Didn't mm -hmm. I mean you are behind you are trailing, but I didn't think it was trailing by that much that we needed a to be desperate. But what's it? I know you know this is such a weird position. Yes, yes. I don't know I, what is supposed to happen. That five four which led me to make the ace and the deuce points, I didn't know what to do. Starting at single plus, just to get a quick, quick reaction, it's uh, not a double, 0.174. You're a favorite, but not enough of a favorite, and it's not gaminish enough to yeah. take it. Let's yeah. see what double plus says. You know, I always say, I, I, as a lawyer, you say, I want a second opinion. Yeah. You know, and usually it just confirms the first one, like appeals court. <laughs> um, So it said it was not a double. Yeah. Okay. So then, things turn around. I get my... I 
place. Uh, yeah, you came out with a double force. Yeah, that's not... <laughs> I have checkers on the nine point. Oh, you know what? In that last position, I don't think it mattered. My checkers were on. I put them on the eight instead of the nine. Oh. I don't think that mattered too much. Right. Um, well, if anything, it would have strengthened the conclusion, I think. It, well, it would have... Um, it was giving me two more pips in the race, so it's less of a blunder. Oh, okay. For, for okay. And now, uh, we can revisit that. It's 80 to 92. And I own, I own four cubes. Normally in a straight race, it's like 80 to 90 as the um, point of last mm -hmm. night. Maybe because of our rollish nature of this position, crossovers are going to matter a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I'll say maybe 89 is the point of last tag. So you're three tips behind. I love the point of last tag. Um, uh, so, so I would, ugh, it means I probably should double. Um, if you're three above the point of last tag, and I have I probably should double. Um, well, I'm going to say right around 18%. And 18%, but maybe it's like 17%. If it's 17, I should double. 18, it's close. Mm -hmm. um, but since it's close, but let's see, here we go. It's two nothing, eleven, I'm on board. And Mr. Single Plus says it's a pass and I should have done. Oh. Um, uh, Mr. Double Plus says. So you were three beyond the point of last take. Mm -hmm. And if it's a long race, that puts it at about 18%. I think I'm right in saying your take point's 18%, you're at 16. Um, but because this is sort of a um, medium variance position, um, then it puts you more. It, being three beyond puts you closer to 15%, which is what it says. So I thought your 18 was more like 15. Okay, so then, when I rolled, I, I think, was that when I rolled my 2-1 and you rolled something higher? Probably put it. Yeah, I think, I think you remember you rolled, what? I, I think I got a 2-1. You rolled a 2-1 and I rolled like a... 5-2? 5-2 or a 3-4. So you rolled seven. about 7, so you gained 4 pips on me. Yeah. And I said, oh, I'm not going to do that. And I think that's probably right, because now uh, now it's not even a pass for me, which is what I think I need mm -hmm. to double this. So let's, let's check that it's no double here. It's still a small double. It's wow. Small. Um, maybe because maybe because your point of last take really is at 85 Yeah, for money. And if that's the case... I'm surprised at you. I'm surprised at you. Because uh, I put you at 22%. And I guess maybe the fact that my, I have a lead, but not a giant lead. So... You mean in the in the match score? In the match score. Yeah, yeah. So 2 nothing. is still... It's not like I'm a 5 nothing. Yeah. So, so it's a small double. Okay. And... Um, Um, and then I have a 
stop the clock. 